and welcome back to the Sunday morning fishing show. Well guys, today's a little bit different. I said I'm being in the morning time, it's still the morning time for me, but we're doing it at night. We're doing some night fishing. We're going to be going for some smallmouth bass today. And I just want to quickly say, holy shit, it is ever fucking crazy out there. Holy. Now, I hope everyone is staying the hell inside and being safe, even though it's boring as all hell. But you know what? It's Sunday. You guys can enjoy the Sunday morning fishing show for the day. And hopefully it can take a little stress off from what's going on in the world right now. But anyways, guys, we're catching our first fish here. Let's bring him on in here and see what she's going to weigh. Uh, we're going for smallmouth bass. We're using the old famous river leer. I love that river leer. Uh, we're never going to stop using this leer here because you know what? Look at the fish we're bringing in. Five pounds, seven ounces. Absolutely gorgeous smallmouth bass. Holy. Now, this uh, river leer is from... Berkeley. Berkeley lent us this lure today, guys, and we're going to be using it like crazy, and we're going to be catching lots of little fishies. Holy. Now, there's tons of little fish out here. Now, I'm just, we're targeting the smallmouth bass, so that's why we're using the Berkeley lure. And now, if you want to go for the little guys, you just go slap on a spinner lure. And something a little bit smaller, and you'll catch all the fish in the river. Doesn't matter what the size. But I am targeting the bigger fish, so we're going to keep a little bit of a bigger lure on. And uh, holy shit, 5 pounds, 13 ounces. Holy crap, they're getting bigger. Holy. Man, oh man. You know what, guys? I hope you're enjoying the show today. Uh, we're, like I said, these smallmouth bass, they're really fun fishing for them. I mean, they're super active. Uh, you know what? They're not normally a nocturnal fish, but guess what? Tonight they are, and they're fighting like crazy. They're giving me some nice fight. Uh, you know what? These one fish, uh, uh, everyone fishes for these things. They're almost everywhere, all around North America. Uh, they are tended to be more in the deeper water, though, like the the lakes, not so much in the rivers. You will catch them in the river. Hells yeah, will you ever? But they most certainly like the deeper waters compared to the largemouth. The largemouth bass, they really enjoy being more in the shallows. In the nice warmer weather where a lot of uh, bait fish tend to hang out, you'll find a lot of largemouth bass just kind of hanging out at the top of the water, waiting for stuff to kind of attract them. But the smallmouth bass, uh, they usually go down deep and uh, hang out near the bottom of the rivers or in the lakes there. And holy shit, we got a whole bunch of fishies out there. We got one on right now, bringing it in. Holy. Now, whoever the hell's watching this show, you guys are absolutely awesome for hanging out with me today. Uh, joining in uh, with the old sponsored lure today, which is doing really well. Thank you, Berkeley, for throwing us this fantastic river leer and man oh man are we catching fish today five pounds twelve ounces holy shit you can't get any better than that that's a gorgeous bass right there man holy i would not mind catching maybe a six pound bass uh that's unheard of though uh you can get awfully close but you can't get that number digit up there holy now let's get these fishies in here. This one's way out there. Holy, this might take me a minute to bring in, but that's all right. I love the fight the fish. I love hearing them rip the reel, all that line out of the reel there. I love that sound. Look at all those fish out there, man. Holy, this thing's fighting like crazy. It just don't want to come in yet. Holy. Man, oh man, this show is really fun to make, man, I tell you what, I've been doing it for almost over a year now, I think, and it's just super fun. You get to have a little bit of silliness come out of you, and just, holy shit, what's this fish going to weigh? Oh man, 5 pounds, 11 ounces, they're getting a little bit smaller on me as we go, aren't they? But you know what, that's a gorgeous fish, holy, man, oh man. Well, guys, I'm just going to, we're going to do a few more casts here. Maybe get a couple more fishies here. Then we're going to call it a night. Because uh, this guy is a little bit tired still. 
uh, my coffee. You know what? I'm running low on coffee, and holy hell, I don't know if I want to go and braise the grocery stores right now. So I might be going without coffee for a little bit, and that's going to make uh, the old fishing show a little bit grumpy. So maybe next week it'll be a grumpy fishing show. I'll be all pissed off, screaming at the fish. What in the hell's going on? I want my damn coffee. Anywho, guys, I don't know why I'm talking about coffee so much. Holy. Let's just bring in this fish here. And then we're going to call it a night. So, like I was saying, I really enjoy you guys hanging out with me, coming on in here. I know it's not a super popular show or nothing, but if you guys share the video and stuff like that, put it up on the old Facebook and the, and the Google Twitter face and all that stuff, uh, that would really help the show. Oh, man. Look at that. It's down another ounce there. Five pounds, ten ounces, beautiful smallmouth bass. Look at that. You know what? They're not the best eating, but when you're on survival mode, I would eat those things all day long. No problem at all, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the show today. If you did, make sure you share, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.